Commission, the rebuilding of this great nation of ours may fall to you. That's why we at vault have prepared these educational materials for you to better understand the seven defining attributes that make you special. Our next area of attention is intelligence. With all the talk of physical survival in the wasteland, you may forget that sometimes it's survival of the smartest. An empty mind is a vessel for knowledge, and intelligence is the key to unlocking opportunity and adapting to your new world above ground. Your advanced know-how will grant you access to new places, and new technologies. Space age, isn't it? Intelligent survivors are also more inventive, creating technological wonders of their own. Note that the S in science stands for safety. And when the tables are turned against you, don't be afraid to set aside your refined intelligence for the raw instincts of survival. Just don't lose your head. Advanced learning in the field of intelligence can offer even more benefits in this modern age of wonder to start navigating with technological ease. Keep blood where it belongs by healing and in creating more potent chemical compounds from regularly study your vault tech provided materials to prepare for survival. And to answer the question, do you know what makes you special? All right, 77 percent. subsequent fallout will have many adverse effects on life as we know it. Intensive prolonged radiation exposure may transform those above ground into decrepit, rotting beings that have lost their ability to reason. They will likely be without common manners and quick to anger. You must learn to make the most of available firearms, but enthusiasm will only take you so far. Now let's try that again. And remember that with your impressive agility, you can act more decisively in bats. See? It's a snap. Agility can also help you out in difficult moments. But why place yourself under undue stress? Instead, try a subtler route. Taking the quieter approach is always worth consideration. Your agility can turn a sneak attack into a complete tactical move. Keep in mind, others may have the same bright idea. Your agility will help you move through the wasteland with ease and yield other benefits.
benefits like assaulting an unsuspecting dreamer for the in hastily reloading your firearms by piling on damage to additional targets when the regularly study your vault tech provided materials to prepare for survival and to answer the question do you know what makes you special Okay, 93%. So this is the last uh, video clip. total atomic annihilation, the rebuilding of this great nation of ours may fall to you. That's why we at Vault-Tec have prepared these educational materials for you to better understand the seven defining attributes that make you special. Got your rabbit's foot? Good. It's time we talk about luck. The difference between whether you live or die in the post-nuclear world may depend on the flip of a coin. Luck is a mysterious sort of curiosity. See here? A well-placed shot may not always do the trick. If Lady Luck favors you, though, you'll find those critical moments a breeze. What's this? Only scrounging up duds? Oh yeah? Okay. Yeah. Let me know when you want to start. I can press start. Yeah, it's dead down. I was like watching these lovely animations. Where's the cat? Oh, there he is. Cat, you're supposed to sit on top of me. That's, that's your job. Oh, that's my water. Okay, I have a cat. Hey, cat. Okay. We'll try playing this game. Wait, did I even do the right thing? Did I just quit? Press any button. Okay. I know. Okay, new. So I just bought this game, so we'll see. We'll see if I like it. I'll play for like half an hour. Which is probably just enough to like watch the first initial intro video or something. Okay, cat cat selling in. Good. That's the correct cat spot. Now this map thing. No, this is like a List of capabilities.
war. War never changes. I know. In 1945. I got, a, I got a cat and a person. My great great grandfather serving in the army wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the US ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. <coughs> for my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing. It's that war. War never changes. Some pretty serious feels. I'm assuming at some point I get to do something, yeah. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Oh man, I gotta like sculpt things. Jeez. I have to shave? No, I have to like change what. You, nowadays, you just, you have to update everything. Hey, my turn, big guy. Okay, great. And I'm a lady. Well, I'll just play as this, because, like, whatever. That's cool. You can spend, like, 20 billion hours selecting your character, so I can't, I can't really do that. Hey, hon. I'll just be a minute. All right, when do I get to shoot things with a gun? I'm... Another fine product of General Atomics International. The Braxo for all your cleaning needs. Doot, doot. I have a nice ah, home. Good morning, Mountain. Your coffee. 
Sugar bombs. 100% daily value of sugar. Thanks, Codsworth. How can someone so small drink so much? It's a little early to be drinking. Hun? Can't believe it's almost Halloween. Need to finish making Sean's costume. Okay, so this game you just drink? Auto late nights. It was worth it. I I have to like do something <laughs> to we get the game to happen. I'm glad we got God's worth. It's probably gonna take me two. I mean, this is like a Bethesda game, so it's probably like 80 hours to like get anywhere. I have to do something. I don't know what. Enjoy your coffee, Mom. Oh wait, I have to like have an emotional event with a baby. <laughs> so this shows you have something to lose, you know. Codsworth? Ah, chores and more chores, my endless joy. Uh, it's that salesman again. I don't like Wonder what Sean will grow up to be. Apparently you're supposed to drink the coffee. I'm just supposed to drink the coffee, all right. Get the, let's get to the coffee. Wait, there's a bedroom, I need to get to the sink. I don't understand, there's no crates for me to smash and take ammo out of. I don't, I just don't understand. Okay, hold on. Hold on, I gotta get to the kitchen. Wait, what's this? Nothing. All right. Do do do. Go get coffee. Where's the coffee? Oh yeah. Good idea. Okay. Grognak the Barbarian and the Jungle of the Bat Babies. <laughs> Maybe if we ignore him, he'll go away. <sighs> More of the same. Cool, I'm in Boston. Great. I know this. Uh oh. Clock. Good morning. Vault Tech calling. Vault Tech? Remind me again. Why, we're about you, ma'am, and helping secure your future. You see, Vault Tech is the foremost builder of state of the art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. Luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. I'm here now. So you are. <laughs> so you are. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being um, <laughs> a precious commodity. Wow. I'm here Look today to tell you that like because of so your lucky. family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of uh, total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I love that. I okay, just that. need to verify some information. That's all. Come back some other time. Come on, hon. It's just a little paperwork. Let them fill it out, and it's done. It's just nuclear war, really? Could that actually happen? Of course not, but look, we have Sean to think of now. Come on, it's not like anything's gonna happen. I know, but it's like insurance, just in case. For Sean, you know? Yes, right, just like insurance. So let's get to it. Okay, so this is where I have to do the thing. And what I like about this is it's like, it's just like Dungeons and Dragons, except instead of wisdom, it's called perception. All right, so 
I like agility. So I'll do that. And I like perception. And then you should probably have like It's a me, Lady Ada. Okay, so I'm into like stabby, sneaky games where you stab around, you'd like sneak around and you stab people in the back. Yeah. That's like my favorite. <laughs> Not just in life, but <laughs> in video games. So I think perception and agility is kind of where I want to be at. Okay. And. I'm into endurance, but I think intelligence and luck. I'm kind of into those. We have less damage. I'm not as into charisma, but... There's also another thing I've learned, which is like from playing Skyrim, which I, I totally sucked at because I thought you were supposed to like kind of keep things even. And it turns out that's exactly the opposite way to play. If you try to keep things even, you end up like at level, like I think I loved it, like level 35 and like you're stuck, you can't go anywhere. So you actually have to be uneven. So I think I'm gonna stick with this. Wonderful, that's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have Can my Can I light this on fire? I can't light this on fire, that sucks. Alright. Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that maternal affection. Where is this stupid baby? Go ahead, honey. Okay. I'll be there in a second to help, okay? My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, I fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? That's my boy. On his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Let's get pumpkins instead. Carve jack-o'-lanterns. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? I hope it's told nuclear annihilation. Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh... Trying to get confirmation. Hey, Codsworth. We seem to have what? lost contact with the affiliate stations. News. Oh no. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's um. Confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. We need to get to the vault now. Let's go. I signed up for this vault. It's vault time. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, no. evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Vault, 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 time, let's go vault. That's actually nice outside. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are Wait, why is this distance getting far? We need to get in. We're on the list. I'm on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Good luck, sir. You two, follow me. God, Come on. Sir. What's going to happen to all Excuse those people me. outside Excuse the me. gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Keep moving. Can you jump? 
Step on the platform in the center. <laughs> Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're gonna be okay. I'm I so glad you. I signed up for Oh my god! Hold on! Hold on! Probably just has like retro stuff. Yeah, that doesn't seem like. I don't know. We did it. We made it. Hey. We're okay. Milk. Everyone because because, step because the, the kids like to look at like, retro tech. It's like, oh, look at how fashion. cute and silly it was. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated yeah. in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just. Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. Excuse no, me. No, no. Don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs and through the door there. Just this way, please. Please proceed in an orderly fashion. This one's good. Step over to the table. Take a seat. This way. Just step over to the table. Hey. This way, please. No, there's some Welcome. problem. With our luck, Pick up a suit. They're telling us to wait. Hey. Oh, sorry. You need to get your suit first before Just I can take you in. You'll need your right suits before Thanks. we can take you further. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. <laughs> Everything okay? This is our new home. When do I get to shoot things that look like aliens? Oh, you're gonna love it here. This <sighs> is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. Ma'am? Down in DC. Oh God, honey, what if they didn't make it? How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. It's a good fit, don't you think? Yeah, that's checking everyone off the list. The vault suit is designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? How do you know these people's names? Just step in here and put your vault suit on. It'll be okay. Mommy's right here. Excuse me. See? Honey, step into the chamber. When Could you help me? Ready. This chamber? Uh huh. Could you help me? Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. I'm going to this one. There she is. Yeah. See? and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three, Yeah. That's fine. Alright, so. Okay, cool. Well, I'm gonna cat. Yeah. He's super happy.
cap petting time. Vault Tech do this. gun to shoot things with. We need that at the very last stages of the game. Okay, so we can containers, tools. It's a real pain to get things right. So this one's a tool thing. Chair. Can I take it? No. What is it? All right. Chill out, Tim. Okay, time to get out. Okay, time to hack. They killed my husband. Yeah. And took my baby. They took my baby! Okay. Okay. So it's been... So it's super high tech, but it's in the name of these little low tech computers. Well, you know, people just love, like, CRTs. It was just cute. Maybe the idea is that after, like, you know, World War II, like, we built robots, but we didn't develop better screen technology. 
<clears throat> I can't. I, I can't. I can't log into this terminal. I was totally ready to hack it, but like I can't. There's no hacking involved. Okay, so there's like. So there was like, you know, oh wait, there's a hollow tape. Look at this hollow tape. Oh, you have to get a hollow tape and you can display it. Okay. Cryogenic what? All I need is this coffee cup and this syringe. I, I got a syringe, a screwdriver, and a adjustable wrench. Are you kidding? So stim pack is some sort of like health thing, probably like gets you all excited. All right, so is there anything in there now? Oh look, it is the way out. I think I saw. Yeah, I got I got everything. Still don't have any guns or anything though. Have these gigantic bugs. Gigantic bugs. Press R2, which is. Okay. Oh boy. Yeah! Yay! Eat! <sighs> Giant roaches? What Yay! the hell? Yay! Well, you take the meat and then like it well from what I from what I remember of Skyrim, basically you, you get to like cook and you have to get like eighteen ingredients and like Can you be one of them? And, yeah, you take the meat and you mix it with like onions and spices and then it gives you some other crazy bullshit. So I have a beer bottle. game or something. Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm really bad at Donkey Kong too. I'll probably just play this game inside of a game for three hours now. suit. Okay. 
Okay. Yes. I'm sure if I get to like level 10, I win something, but um, I think I'll play some other time. I have 8,000 coffee cups. Ooh, the toaster. I'll take the toaster. Throw the toaster at something. Bug is still there. <laughs> Yay, more cockroaches. everyone. I don't need this much meat, so I don't I'm gonna come pretty soon be like, you have so much meat. What's the difference between What's the difference between power attack and attack? This seems exactly the same. Hmm. Does that make my HP higher or is it just a coincidence? This is all that's left? Okay, finally, guns. <sighs> Yay. Okay, so basically everyone didn't get out and they all stabbed each other. Nice. Coming back later for you. Arr. I need I need something. Oh, did it? If I only oh, had no, a bobby, bobby pin. pin. Yeah, bobby pin. Sorry, fine. 
Yes, I'm another gun. Thank you. I can now shoot things. And then... Yeah, see? Now we're talking. Dresser. Bobby pins. Gotta keep moving. Bobby pins. Come on, I would, I would put them here. See? That's where you put bobby pins, on the mirror. Okay, now you gotta come back. Look for me. Well, I would like to pee, but I can't. Apparently you do not have to in this game. So yeah, I can go back and get that gun. Bigger guns. Okay. Lock's really strong. Oh no, I need skills and shit. <laughs> Ugh, this is Skyrim-y. I wish I could just shoot this. All right, so you have to like practice with bobby pins. It's actually, this, it's funny. It's like the same thing in Skyrim. You have to like, practice and you get better at it. And it like buzzes and you like twiddle knobs and things. All right, well, I think I took everything I could out of here. Maybe I can shoot some more stuff later. Come back here, play more video games instead of video games. Gotta find the terminal. <sighs> All right. Hey, there's some glasses. All right. Yes. I, hope, I hope I don't have to like win that game to unlock it. <laughs> Oh, I don't, I don't have a dog. I'm a cat. Yes. A cat beast. He's like, why did you do that to me? Okay. Well, I'll get good. I'm actually, I'm pretty good at the unlocking thing with like, I mean, if it's, if it's Skyrim-like. Okay, so L2, L2 is this one. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Press L1 to target enemy vats. What the hell is this? To mark a target for attack, press R2, guns can... Okay, this is way too complicated. I just want to shoot things. Okay, hold on. Oh, this is not very... Okay. I'm gonna practice. There you go. Alright, just takes time. Okay. So the question is, does your HP heal over time? You have to do something? Like before, it seemed like if I drank some water, Yeah, see, water actually heals you. Whoa. The only thing is, I don't think I have that much. Uh... You only have 80 rounds. So. To use a gun, huh? I can't. How do I go back to melee? Options? No. Whoa. That's not what I wanted. Up. Oh, wait. I have a thing. The thing says aim, block, bash, attack. Favorite. 
No, this is really... I cannot go back to melee. I guess I just have to use all my... my ammo and then... Okay, oh, I see, it does, it does 12 rounds. Okay, that's cool. And then how do you do inventory? Inventory is... Wait, how do you do inventory? Hip boy? No? You can, you can do melee in. Well, now it won't let me do anything. Okay, to mark a character, I press R2. So this is the vats. Which I don't even know what that means. Aim block. Switch to nearby enemies with R. Okay, so this is some sort of like automatic targeting system or something. Somewhat. I think you just have to shoot things. Press R3 to sneak. Whoa. Okay, well, I'm not gonna get to sneak. Wait, R3. What button is R3? How can there be so many buttons? Oh, R1. I see. R1, but then when is R3 to sneak? Oh, white, white stick. No? Oh, I see. Okay, this is totally Skyrim-y. Okay. Hidden. Come here, little guy. Yes. Delicious. Alright, well, that was kind of effective. Yay! I have the thing. I have the portal gun. Now I can shoot portals. Totally pressing R2 and R3, okay. Pistol. Data. Out of time. Quests. Map. Radio. Nothing. Inventory. Okay, how do I equip? Who knows? Some pack. Yeah, 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 I'm kind of getting up now. 
Look, I just like sitting, all right? It's a brave new world. <laughs> what? Yes, I want to go to the green square. This is the Joseph Campbell part where you are transformed and you, you know. Where you came in the beginning. You, yeah, you're, you're now, now you're gonna go, out. go out. Uh, this is probably my last chance to change stuff, but I don't know. Maybe every, like, quest, you get to mess with your abilities. So it's like, oh, this quest, you really need a lot of strength to, like, pull the knob, and then you need a lot of agility. Enjoy your return to the surface, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. Okay, well, Let's call it. that's it. I played. I played the level. Okay, we'll do it again. We'll do it again. But that was uh, that was our first test. We're using. Yeah, we're actually our HDMI input test. We're probably going to be doing it with Raspberry Pi, but PS4 yeah. is also a good thing to test. Yeah, with. we've got everything's working. It's really bizarre. Okay, well, as soon as this ends, this cutscene, I'll, um, we'll save. It's done, time for cat. Okay, so, let's do, that's not how I wanted to do it. Whoa, hold on, save. Okay. And then, uh, there you go. I played a game. I mean, there's like modding stages for workbenches. Oh my god, this is like a game. <clears throat> All right, so this is like it's like nuclear Skyrim, basically. Instead of instead of modding and like smithing, I'm sure you do like nuclear science and stuff. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.